and salted butter, baking soda, all-purpose flour, eggs, vanilla, wash sugar, Kisses Dark, Other Kisses, Reese's, Kit Kit and Hershey's. To mini chocolate, choose your own chocolates. Bowl and strainer, measuring cups. Now let's strain the all-purpose flour. So we would just get the finest flour. By the way, we used for cups of all-purpose flour that was strained. Now you can see why straining the flour is needed. So we would not end up with dried and big chunk of hard flour on the mix. Then add two teaspoon of baking soda. Then mix the flour and baking soda. Add one and a half teaspoon or a pinch of salt. Now place one bar of butter or three quarters cup of unsalted butter on the stainless steelware with a cup of brown or washed sugar. Then add 5 teaspoon of white or granulated sugar. If you want more sweetness, then you can add 2 more spoons. After that, add 3 teaspoonful of vanilla for flavoring and aroma. Now add 3 eggs in the mixture. The eggs should be fresh or not like a 5 day old egg. Here is what it should look like. It's mixing time. This was hard work because we didn't have the automatic whisker. It was fun and an exercise. Don't over mix it. I would recommend that you would take it out the unsalted butter earlier so it's a bit softer. Mix, 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 mix till you will have a good consistency. Still mixing, I should have really taken out the butter earlier. Lesson learned. Now let's add the dry mixture on the wet mixture. And another round of mix, 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 mixing till forever her her.
gently mixing it not so hard and fast so it wouldn't be over mixed. Wishing we did bought an electric mixer had this was fun. And as I mentioned, good exercise. Once you have this consistency, you should stop and rest for a bit. It's almost yummy cookies. Now let's add some chocolate that was broken to pieces, or small pieces of chocolate, then slightly mix it together. Yum, I love kisses dark and milky. Add these for more chunky chocolate filling inside the cookie. Swirl mixing, that's just me. Then add butter on the baking plate or sheet. And grab your ice cream scoop to scoop a big chunk of cookie mix. Better form a shape mine was just a simple circle. We are almost there to taste our cookie. You should have preheated for about 30 minutes to 1 hour. The oven at 120 up to 150 Celsius depends on your cooking batter. Now is the exciting part, place your cookie plate inside the oven. And observe how your cookie will bubble up and become the cookie you want to eat. That my talking pot holder, now close and wait. Look how it formed and it will still form until it is cooked. I was a bit nervous at this time. Voila, it looks skewed just a bit crispy at the bottom. Here is the cookies. Let's indulge and enjoy each flavor cookie with different chocolates on top. Yum, it's very gooey cookies. You can try to sell it too. Thank you for watching everyone, don't forget to hit subscribe, like and comment down below, see you on the next video.